how is life? So you have it, you have your, you're a full solo. Is that correct? Extremely solo dolo. I mean, I, I even wait in line at the post office sometimes. You know, I, I didn't get any sponsor from, but I it did that here in LA. It's just such a line. Uh, I started getting stamps.com where I print it out and I have uh, stamps.com that you order a bunch of like envelopes. And so I just take those and I, the post office has a drop off and I do it there. I print it out. So I don't have to wait in line anymore. That, that was a godsend. It saves a lot of time. So I used to have to wait and uh, it just makes it so much easier to do that. Um, wow. It's something to check out. But yeah, I was full soul for 10 years. We we're talking about it a little briefly. Um, you know, it, there's a lot of, personal attention you give people in a case when you're full solo, which I really love. Uh, and it was really good. Um, and, uh, you know, clients love it, obviously, and you, you keep most of the money and overhead just dramatically goes down. Uh, but, you know, I just recently hired an associate. What I've, the, the one thing we talked about earlier and started to take on the conversation, definitely jump in is bringing people on board, especially the longer you are doing full solo it becomes harder and harder because of like trust issue. Cause you know, like, you know, I'm going to do this. I do it right. How much time is it going to take? And, uh, it's a hard thing, I think. But if you find the right person, um, it, it's, it, it makes it easy. But finding the right person is, is a needle in a haystack itself. But look, there's these big firms that have like 100 lawyers or something like that. They're pulling it off. So it's a, it's a complex thing.